AITA for saying, just don't come to my stepmom when she and my dad told me she didn't want to attend my high school graduation with my mom. BG, my parents divorced when I, 18M, was three because my dad was having an affair with my stepmom. My mom and stepmom were work rivals and had a strong dislike for each other even before the affair. There has always been speculation that this is why my stepmom willingly became the other woman, because she disliked my mom. I was aware of this, and not because of my parents, but because of drama that would kick off with my dad's side of the family, and I was present for some of my dad's relative speculations about this. My parents did not get along after the affair and tensions were high whenever my mom and stepmom were in the same room. My stepmom had three pregnancies that ended in miscarriage. The first two were I guess typical slash normal miscarriages, but the third one caused my stepmom a lot of medical issues, and that led to her being infertile. So she and my dad never got to have a living child together. After the third miscarriage, my stepmom wanted me around because she wanted to feel like a parent and she wanted to know she would still have me. She and my dad asked my mom if they could extend their time with me, and my mom laughed in her face and told her she didn't care what she had been through and she would not let me be used as a band-aid. My stepmom argued that she deserved compassion for what she was going through and it would be good for me to get that little extra attention and love since I wasn't going to have siblings ever. My mom told her she'd never have compassion for her and didn't feel sorry for her at all. She told her she didn't deserve to be a mom after taking part in the end of my stability within my family. She did blame my dad too, but that has never been focused on as much by my dad and stepmom or his family. After that my mom and stepmom were never in the same place together. They had third parties take care of exchanges of me until I was old enough to hop out of a car and into the home I was returning to. Once they realized I knew details of what happened, my dad and stepmom were vocal about mom being cruel slash hurtful to my stepmom and that was why they weren't ever in the same room together. A few times I picked up on their desire for me to hate my mom for them, but I don't. I try to stay neutral, which my mom encourages, but if I have to pick, like with this, I'm hashtag team mom all the way. I'm graduating from high school in a couple of months, and my dad and stepmom brought up that my stepmom doesn't feel like she should be around my mom and does not want to be there with my mom. They told me they feel it would be best if I make it clear to mom that she can't be there. I told them my mom will be there. Then my stepmom told me she can't be in the same room as her after what she did. So I said just don't come. I told her I wasn't going to beg her to be there. I wanted my mom there and they weren't going to stop me. They asked me how I could say that knowing how mom treated my stepmom and they asked me to be more compassionate. Ida, 